if you went out to the sixth annual Star Spangled celebration on the river. We hope you had a great time and enjoyed those fireworks. Our Delady Dukes was there. Maybe you saw her. She caught up with some folks who were trying to enjoy the evening and also stay cool. The 4th of July came one night early. Thousands of people gathered in Hattiesburg's Chain Park and Petal River Park to celebrate Independence Day. From live music to local vendors, the heat did not stop the fun at Chain Park for the Star Spangled Celebration on the river. One way many describe the night? Hot. It's hot. It's hot. It's real hot, like 100 degrees hot. It is very hot. It is very hot. It's very warm. It's, it's not as bad as when we first got here. It's very hot out here. And everyone did whatever they could to cool down. We're going to keep Gatorade, water, keep your electrolytes up, and do what they need to do to keep cool. Really just keep fanning this thing until I get tired, and then I switch hands and fan it with the other. Yeah. Some decided to cool down with an ice cream eating contest. I mean, I'm not sweating as much anymore. But despite the heat, many event goers say this is an event they can't miss every year. Come out here and enjoy the fireworks, grab some food and a lawn chair and sit and watch the fireworks. It's fun, like we're having a good time. It's just a lot of people, a lot of good things going, good music too. In Hattiesburg, Delaney Dukes, WDAM 7 on your side. Well, if you missed tonight's event, Paul B. Johnson State Park is holding a 4th of July event tomorrow night. Families are invited to come spend the day swimming, fishing, or boating on the lake. The park opens at 8 a.m. with a fireworks show that night, tomorrow night, happening at 9 p.m.